There's so many layers to this divorce. It's so f***ing complicated. It's very difficult to explain. You know, I'm sure that they were very shocked and that they're going to have a lot of questions. If you're a fan of Real Housewives of Beverly Hills, you had a busy week, because not only were you watching last night's episode of Housewives of Beverly Hills, but you kicked off this Monday with Housewives and the Hustler, which, no shock, leads the biggest OMG moment to Erica Jane's divorce bomb drop. I did not see it ending this way. I was going to hold that man's hand until he died. While all the ladies were kind of shocked about this, Kyle had some interesting tidbits to say about Tom and Erica's marriage. Erica sent a text saying that she was going to be filing for divorce from Tom. Actually, record scratch that. Kyle had a lot to say, <laughs> as she is one to do, about not only Tom and Erica's marriage, but how Erica broke this news and how Kyle felt about it. <laughs> When you sort of look at their marriage from afar, you're not really that shocked. I know that if I was going through divorce, I would have shared it with these women. I'm not judging, I'm just thinking, gosh, I thought we were closer than that. Rena was also pretty shocked about this divorce news ripping through Beverly Hills. I didn't know until she sent that text to us today, today at 9.15, and I instantly called her, and you know, I was just as surprised as, as we all were. There was just no sign of anything that would lead to a divorce. What is so funny about the Real Housewives is that a lot of them were housewives, but then became divorced wives. <laughs> so they have some tidbits on how they handle their divorce. Garcelle and Sutton did differ. I do have to say, though, <laughs> I don't know if it was the joy of a Biden victory or just one to three of these champagne coupes that uh, Garcelle was hooking back. <laughs> Her thought of why <laughs> she shocked Erica and Tom are divorcing did leave me in stitches. And also, we were all thinking it. Don't you even get twisted with that. Shouldn't she wait? For what? I know what you're thinking. I literally know what you're thinking. What were you going to say? I don't know. I just feel like they've been married that long. Like, oh, wait. But as you oh. know, oh, stop it, Garcia. I didn't oh. say it. Tom is 82. But now, let me tell you, people live until they're like 100 now. Obviously, the Bravo producers know what they're doing, and they didn't have Erica come in until the final 15 seconds. It was shorter than a TikTok. That's how long Erica Jane was in this episode. So I know what I'm doing next Wednesday. I'm going to be glued to the TV watching how she describes this, and especially now that we know everything. It is expensive to be you. <laughs>